Rafa Benitez's side fought back after goals from Dominic Calvert-Lewin and Richarlison saw the visitors two in front at the half-time break. Matt Ritchie had missed a penalty in between either strike, but Salman Rondon reduced the deficit to one before Perez struck twice within the space of three mites late on. What an amazing feeling, the Spanish attacker said. Such a great comeback. There are still a few games to go, but we are closer to safety. The reaction was very good from the team in the second half. That togetherness with the fans took us to what we did on an amazing day at St. James Park. Calvert-Lewin opened the scoring with a header into the bottom corner on 18 minutes. The hosts were then awarded a penalty after Jordan Pickford hauled down Rondon in the box on the half-hour mark, the Venezuelan looked certain to score into an open goal when Pickford committed the foul and was lucky to start on the pitch. Referee Lee Mason decided to show Pickford a yellow card and the St. James Park crowd were incensed when Pickford kept out Ritchie's effort. Everton went up the other end just one minute later and Richarlison made it 2-0 from close range as the Toffees looked on course for only their second victory in seven matches. But Newcastle were a different proposition in a rousing second half. First Perez set up Rondon with a lovely flick over the top and the striker dispatched his volley with a plum on 65 minutes. They had to wait until the 81st minute for the equaliser when Perez pounced as Pickford parried Miguel Amiron's long-range effort. And the crowd went into raptures when Perez slotted home after coming back from an offside position to clinch an important three points. Manager Benitez heaped praise on his goal scorers and even went so far as to compare them with Barcelona star Lionel Messi. This team is important, he said. The link between A is Paris and Salim and Rondon, if Messi was doing that everybody would be talking about the goal. The players deserve to win these five games in a row at home 